Welcome to today's lesson. Today we are going to be discussing doubles and halves. We are going to identify half of the shapes. What is a halving and what is halving shapes? This is a whole pizza. The pizza has now been cut into two halves. Each piece is the same size. This is one half of the pizza. Now, to make sure something is half, it has to be the same on both sides. It has to be the same size. Now, if we're going to cut this pizza, we have to cut it in the middle. So we have to have the same on this side and the same on that side. Think about it like sharing with your friends. If you and your friend are having a pizza and you want it to be fair, then you have to each have the same size. So this half will be for you and this half will be for your friend. Each piece is called a half. Let us look at the, the, the cake. Find the missing half of the cake. If you think it's this one, well done. When you put the two halves together, it makes a whole. Half of this ice cream is missing. Can you find the other half? Each half is the same size. Let us look at the chocolate. Half of this chocolate is missing. Can you find the other piece of the chocolate that looks the same as this piece over here and it's the same size? I don't think it's this one. Nope, not this one. Yes, this is the one. Excellent. So when you put it together, it makes a whole pizza. Can you find the other half of the melon? This one's easy. There we go. How many people can share the melon when it is in halves? Now remember, if you want to be fair, because it's always good to be fair, then you need to give each person the same amount. So how many people do you think will be able to eat this melon? If you guessed two, well done. One person will take this half, and another person will take that half. Half of this pineapple is missing. Can you find the other half? There we go. Now, when we put the two halves together, it makes a whole pineapple. Click on the next video for me to continue this lesson on halving numbers. Assalamu alaikum.